Hey everybody, this is Jeff from My Cook Better and Your Mom and today I decided to kick Starbucks right in the ass. That's right, I'm gonna be showing you how to make your own cold brew coffee at home. A couple of minutes and it's gonna be way better. You ready? Let's go! All right, so this is very, very simple, you guys. All we have to do is mix our coffee in our water, but there's a little bit of a tricky part. We do need to wait 24 hours and let this brew. All right, cool. So we're just gonna mix our coffee. I already brought, uh, I already bought this, um, this beautiful branded coffee. Um, if you want to buy the coffee beans, by all means do, but you have to make sure that when you grind it, you set it for coarse. That's very, very important. So, now that we've our coffee's here, I'm a little bit scared that it might be a little bit too tight, but let's give it a try. Let's pour our water very, very slowly. It worked. <laughs> all right, so all we need to do is just stir this real quick so our beautiful coffee mixes with everything else. Ah, oh, coffee got some, dude. All right, guys, so 24 hours have passed and now it's time for the filtration process. So here I've got a paper towel that I previously, that I have previously uh, sucked in water. So it's a little bit damp at the moment. I need one of these little strainer guys. I could have gotten a bigger one. I could have gotten a bigger one, but hey, that's unfortunately all I have, so you know. Our coffee is ready and Time for a smell. Let's see, it might be a little bit too. Oh my god. Oh my god, my god, my god. You guys have no idea how fucking excited I am at the moment. I swear, man. This step might be a little bit tricky, so be careful. And time to go. Just do it fast, don't even think about it. So the filtration process is pretty much going to, we're going to repeat it twice or maybe three times if you're a little bit picky. The first time we're not going to use any paper towel or anything. We're just going to use this strainer and then we're just going to let it, let everything, let that beautiful coffee get in there. And then the second one we are going to use with our filter with, which is our paper towel. Look at this. This is like I would say for a week worth of coffee Probably a little bit less. So now it's time to make this shit happen I've got this mason jar right here with I would say like halfway filled with ice or probably like three quarters So to this I'm going to add I would say like around a third of my beautiful cold brew coffee and There you go and we are going to add our beautiful almond milk. All right, so to that, I'm going to add, this is, this is going to be very, very optional, guys. That's the one. The same one they use at, um, at Starbucks, believe it or not. So this is totally optional, but it, it gives, it takes it to a whole different level though. So if you want to, I'm just gonna leave the, the description for it um, down below so you can buy it yourselves. There you go. I would say, pff, what is that? Like, probably like half a teaspoon or like a teaspoon. So, this is it guys. That is pretty much it. As always, remember to click the subscribe button, the like button, and if you've got any questions or whatever, let me know in the comment section down below. 
So this is Jeff from my cook better and your mom, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.